Can you throw up, like, inside your body? Uh-huh. I know, because I just did. About five times. Wow. Look at this place. All these tracks converge at this point. You could probably get anywhere in the world from here. There's the portal. This is what Gabriel was talking about. That's our way out. It must lead back to the surface. The surface is also where that creature is. He's right. We have no idea what we're walking into. It could be dangerous. Thanks for being so brave, Axel. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm going. I'm going right now. Like right, right now. You can do it, Axel. That's right, I can do it. Whatever's on the other side has no idea what it's got coming. All right, here I go. Thanks, Jesse. Right behind you. Be safe up there, Axel. Ready or not, here I come. close I'm never going first again where are we in the dark in the middle of nowhere maybe we should bed down for the night it's dangerous to be out when it's just dark I thought we were headed toward a temple we're looking for a giant building it should be pretty obvious. Ivor said... No, Ivor said... Well, then maybe this is the temp... I'm being sarcastic. Axel, come on. Take it easy, Axel. He called me stupid. No, I didn't. But you wanted to. No, I didn't. Huh? Did you say something? We have to build a shelter. I thought that was what I said, but, uh... Yep, that's totally... <laughs> it's getting dark and stuff. I say we build a treehouse. That'll take forever, and we'll be exposed while we do it. We just need a quick and dirty hut. Look, whatever it is, we gotta do it fast. What? Let's go with a treehouse. It's functional. It'll keep us out of danger. It's not a bad idea. All right, fine. Let's get started, then. If I wake up with a spider on my face, I'm gonna expect you to deal with it. Lower your expectations, Axel. Well, maybe if we'd built into the tree a little bit more, it could've... Never mind. It's... this is fine. It's good. Looks good, guys. Oh, man! What? I'm going to tell you something. You have to promise not to freak out. What is it? I have cookies. One for me. One for Olivia. One for Jesse. Thanks, Axel. And one for Reuben. <laughs> Sorry, Lucas. I only have four. Oh, no. It's... it's all right. I'm not that hungry anyway. If you had to, which would you rather fight? A hundred chicken-sized zombies, or ten zombie-sized chickens? Choose wisely. 
Uh, that's a good one. Let me think. How can you guys joke at a time like this? Petra is still out there. She's all by herself. Can't just mope. Gotta keep our spirits high. No, we should be moping. That's exactly what we should be doing. Axel. I'm right, right? Maybe, but she's going to be fine. What makes you think that? She has to be. Fine. Then, uh... We should get some rest. We gotta start looking for this temple as early as we can. Now, my guess is if we start at the portal and kind of split Whoa, up... Oh, what are you doing? Did I do something to you? I'd really like to know. We'll figure it out in the morning. Maybe you're right. I... I'm pretty exhausted. Jesse means us, not you. Axel, we'll figure it out in the morning. You're the only one wearing that stupid jacket. Don't tell us what to do. Take that back. Can't. Wouldn't. You know what? I get to wear this jacket because I know how to build. But that doesn't mean I don't know how to break things. Your threats don't scare me now that we know how you really are. Jesse, your friend is way out of line. I wasn't going to bring it up, but I can only take so much. Let's just drop it. Don't be like that, Jesse. Just drop it. Haven't you done enough damage for one day? Petra might be dead because of you. You're taking this too far, Axel. I don't have to take this. Listen, why don't I just leave and let you guys hash this out? You can't leave. It's dangerous out there. I can take care of myself. It's what Axel wants, right? Let him leave if he wants to leave. You're not going anywhere. But Jesse... That's enough. We're all on the same team now. He's staying. Zombie-sized chickens. That's what I would fight. Why's that? Because I'm starving. Of course. Rain is better than monsters. Thanks for keeping me around, Jesse. Yeah. Listen, don't worry. Hey, Axel will get over it. But still, the way it all went down wasn't cool. Give it time, he'll come around. Thanks, Jesse. See anything? Hey! There's something over that way! What is it? Some kind of building, I think. Let's get a closer look. Waiting for, let's go. What is this place? That's what we're trying to figure out. It's the Temple of the Order of the Stone. Lucas, are you sure? He's right. Look. Holy crap. Do you think they're in there? Let's go in and find out. Let's just all be careful. Okay. If you spot anything, call it out. We don't have a lot of time. Isn't it weird how dispensers are carved to look like spooky little faces? What do you dispense, little guy? I get the feeling that we don't really want to find out. Get behind me. Probably not a good thing. Oh, come on, dispenser faces. I thought we were friends. Run! <laughs> we 
We're trapped! We activated the dispensers with that pressure plate. If we can figure out a way to trigger it again, I bet that'll shut them off. There's a crafting table. Maybe we can make something useful. Out of what? We don't have anything. All of our tools and materials are back home. All right, everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see what we've got to work with. I have a few sticks left over from building the shelter last night. I've got some flint and a piece of string. All I have are some chicken feathers I picked up after that chicken machine exploded. Uh, let's see, I've got some flint and steel, a sword. Oh, and some string from a spider that I fought. String, sticks, flint, and feathers. Do this. All right. The Nether Maniac's luck is changing. This must be their enchantment room. Doesn't this look like Ivor's creepy basement? Find anything useful? Not sure about useful, but definitely interesting. There is a lot of history in this room. The battle was fierce, but the Order of the Stone emerged triumphant, saving the land and ensuring that peace and prosperity would reign forever. Well, not exactly forever. These five, five members, five friends, together would give so much to gain their rightful place as five, five heroes. They would author their own end. They would... The stories never mentioned him. This is so crazy. There must be a reason he's never been mentioned. Maybe he was different back then. Maybe they kicked him out. This is so crazy. The Order might not be what we thought they were, but Petra is still out there. That monster is still out there. Jesse's right. We need to focus on what we came here to do. Where do these stairs go? They go up. Now this is cool. Wow. What happened to the walls? More like what happened to this whole place. This must have been where they met. So where are they then? Gabriel said that once we find the temple, the amulet would lead us to the Order of the Stone. Well, what are you waiting for? Pull it out then. Is something supposed to happen? Well, that was a letdown. There's got to be something we're missing. Look around and see if you can find anything. What you looking at? Nothing. Whatever. Axel? I was just trying to figure out where Petra might be. I mean, I know she's gonna be fine, but I was just curious. We're gonna find her. Find anything interesting in that book? The only thing I've found so far is that the amulet was used to track the positions of the members of the Order. And does it mention how? It's less technical and well, more historical.
It's the same as the amulet. It's a map of the entire world. This is way nicer than the one at Endercon. We're in the temple of the Order of the Stone. The Order's actual temple. Who'd have thought it, huh? A bunch of small towners like us wrapped up in an adventure like this. Yeah, it's pretty insane. I just hope we all come out the other side in one piece. Hey, Reuben, find any clues? Absolutely incredible! How did they build this? Okay, now I'm impressed. This looks like some sort of tracking system. It's the order. It's showing where they are right now. Look, we don't know enough about how this thing works. Maybe the amulet only tracks them when they're on the surface. Or maybe it doesn't work when they're in the nether. We have to go off what we do know. There are only two lights on that map. If there are only two heroes left, then we know what we need to do. Petra's relying on us. That Witherstorm is still out there. We know that Gabriel was trying to tell us something. We've got to find the Order of the Stone. But there are only two lights. There are only two members of the Order left? He said Soren was missing. That leaves Magnus. Or Eligard. Well, let's head out. I'm not going with you guys. I have to stay here. If I know Petra, she's probably doing everything she can to find this place. She's still out there. She has to be. But just stay safe, okay? If there's even a small chance she's alive, I have to stay. Go. Get help. I'm gonna focus on making this place safe before nightfall. This temple is pretty big, though. If we're gonna have a chance at fortifying it, I'm gonna need some help. If, uh, maybe one of you guys could hang back with me? Sounds like Olivia will have you totally covered while me and Jesse are out finding Magnus. Finding Magnus? You really think that's how it's going to go? We need Eligard. She's the world's greatest engineer. She'll figure out a way to stop that thing. We're trying to destroy it. And when it comes to destruction, Magnus is the master. You're a smart person, Jesse. And obviously, the smart thing to do is to go get Magnus. I... <laughs> think Axel meant Eligard there, Jesse. Uh, no. I don't think I did. Pretty sure Axel meant Magnus. Olivia, you and I are going to Eligard's. Awesome. Axel, you stay here with Lucas and get the place ready for when Petra shows up. What, with that guy? I'm right here. Come on, Axel. For Petra's sake. Fine, I'll do it. For Petra. I'll take it. Uh, guys? Please hurry. <laughs> 